What's up, everybody? We're here to play Legacy of Cain, Soul River. Creepy, creepy game. Um, I think I've already started this. I started this. Don't you my last player? Yeah, okay. So we got through the introduction. That's good. Oh, uh, what was the tag? Okay, that's Soul River. Okay. So the controls are for this game pretty easy. Q to suck souls. E is to attack. Space to jump. And I think we don't... We don't... We don't need a mouse. Oh, okay. That's odd. Wait. Well, let's, let's look. Okay, what's cat up do? Alright, no. Shift do. Crouches. Okay. There we go. Pretty simple. I love this game. But it creeped me out the first time I played it. Okay, I think I've already activated the thing. Alright. Pretty simple dimple controls. I've got a bit. I, first one I played was Legacy of Kane Defiance. And you'll hear me probably play that game soon. I love that game. It's fun, it's enjoyable. So is this one. <coughs> This one was originally released for the PlayStation. Uh, some jumps you have to crouch and then jump. Some jumps you have to glide. Um, I love the fact when you get a soul reaver in this game, which is, uh, yeah, not a soul reaver. What is it called again? Um. Uh, a wraith blade, which the soul reaver is what Cain holds. The wraith blade is what uh, Raziel holds. Alright, let's get this guy. What was the lock on? Oh, yeah, deal hole. I do not like these controls. This game control is so damn weird. There's gotta be a better way. Is there a lock? You can see. I'm gonna get rid of this guy. Um. I remember talking about this game to Kyle. Talking about how amazing it was. Come on, stupid idiot. There we go. Oh. Enter. Does that. Let you select from the regular realm to the spiritual realm. Um, let's see what we got for our controls. Alright. Wow. Forward, back, left, right, jump. Our soul. Okay, so there's no auto lock. Whoa. Alright. Let's go ahead and get through the first part. There we go. Stop crouching. What I liked about the other one was that you had an auto lock, and for some reason, um, that one actually allows you to uh, run it with an actual controller. And I think I might be able to run it with a controller. The only thing I have to do is I have to grab the set of file for that and just move it over to this. I think I'll let you know when I get an update on that. <coughs> well, that's uh, Tony J. One of my favorite actors. So pretty much what he's telling you now is you can go from spiritual realm to physical realm. Which is something someone believes in the regular realm. Okay. Oh, sorry. Also, um, water 
works as thin as air. And the, uh, what is it again? Um, the water sends as light as air in the spiritual realm. Now what you're going to have to do is you're going to have to, uh, um, I think, I think you have to go through here. The only way to get through there is go through the spiritual realm. The only way to do that is to, um, Um, the physical realm and spiritual realm have many different properties. For the physical realm, water can kill you. Or send you back to the spiritual realm, like that. But the spiritual realm is as light as air. Yeah, it'll dissolve your physical body. Heft nor lift. See what I mean? Best way to get across here. Let's do that. And just to go. This game's full of a lot of puzzles. Press the heat open. See, I like it better on the PlayStation. The PlayStation had a lot better controls for it. That's Michael Bell, by the way. Michael Bell's a pretty awesome actor. Uh, from the video game wise, he's done a lot of cartoons. But Michael Bell, my favorite role will always be this. Uh, turning off filter textures does change a bit for the game, for quality wise. But. Okay. Okay, so hold down the auto face. There's not a face, I just didn't see it. Right, hold the grapple. Release. Throw. See what I mean? Okay. So, in that sense. There is a lift right there. One thing I have to do is I have to go up to this. Yes, I know. Okay. Hold E to grab. This game reminds me a lot of a game called Medieval. Pretty awesome game, pretty fun, pretty enjoyable. Played countless hours of it. Alright. Oh, shit. This is what I'm talking about. Let's see the filter textures. I don't move. There we go. Okay. So now we're off to the next part. Which is my least favorite. I think it's either this part. Or the next. Can't honestly remember. So what was the next? Thank you. 
that's pretty much all I have time we have for this video. I'll see you in the next one. Take care.